cute today so I decided to wear a dress or a skirt and then I also decided to work out in it because I don't live by the rules okay you should reevaluate which rules you live by in life okay okay cool thing that I'm grateful for. Sunset coming right through my window and I get to experience it while I'm in the kitchen cooking. It's just super cool. See? It's neat.
car. So the trash trucks finally came and I say this just because I like to say what I'm grateful for and although that may be a small thing, it actually really isn't. Um, so basically here at the apartment neighborhood or whatever, um, we get the trash, the dumpsters emptied like I would think two to three times a week. I haven't really paid attention until now. but. Um, and so like I noticed, we noticed like the last couple days, like the trash just kept piling up and like nobody was coming to empty the dumpsters. And I'm just like, started to get a little nervous because you know, once that starts piling up, then it starts overflowing and stuff. And the majority of people just like, you know, they just pile their garbage there, you know, and not, and they think, you know, not my problem, not my problem. And of course, like Dakota and I were just like, no, that would become our problem. We would somehow, some way, try to figure out like dump run you know we don't have a truck or anything but like we would not let that happen just because like that's just not how we live anyway so the trash trucks finally came this morning i was like so grateful so thankful that like we have empty dumpsters now and like people can just properly throw away their trash no piling up no overfilling nothing like that anyway it got me thinking and got me remembering that um back when dakota and i were drinking um alcohol and consuming alcohol and stuff like that that we used to have two personal sized dumpsters at our house and every single week they would both be full to the brim just of garbage and then um it's kind of funny in a way that once we stopped drinking and once we stopped uh, consuming so much, I know this may sound like a dub, but like we literally dropped down to, we barely even filled up half of one of our little personal dumpsters a week. And so it's just crazy. Once you like, when you're consuming so much like alcohol or like highly processed foods, you should pay attention sometime. Like do a little experiment or whatever. Um, like do a little challenge, if you will. Like go a week without alcohol go a week without um consuming highly processed foods and just look at how much you do not waste like your waste product goes way down like right now like i know we live in an apartment so we have like a community dumpster but when, when we moved out of our house a few months ago like we barely like i said we barely filled up half of our little personal dumpster and like we we cut our waste way down just by cutting out alcohol and cutting out consuming so much highly processed foods it's crazy all the processing that goes on it has so much waste to it so pay attention do a little challenge challenge yourself to go without those products just to see how much you actually save and in turn of course you know have a cleaner area <laughs> 